T to the V to the L to the I to the N to the E, TV line. Welcome, Orphan Black. Hi. Hi. Is Paul alive? No, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> did you see that No, I did see it, but he's here, this and I'm is, like, oh my god. This is my, uh, it's kind of, you know, it's a uh, look back on uh, yeah. the third season, so right. this is kind of like my farewell Is it sort of tour. bittersweet? Yeah, but it's it's fun to be with the family again, so I, yeah, yeah it's, it's pretty great. That was sort of one of maybe the biggest death from the show so far. What was it like for you guys to have to say goodbye? That episode was just amazing. It was amazing to watch Dylan work because Helen Shaver came in and directed oh, yeah. that episode and she just kind of rocks everybody's world. And the work between Dylan and her was really beautiful. I felt like we got an insight into Paul that was new and, and deeper and, and just really made it so impactful. And, He's suddenly just blown up. <laughs> <laughs> but not before Tear. he said he loved Sarah. Yeah, gosh. Yeah. He helped yeah. me. Yeah, that was really good. It was very sad, though. We're not used to saying goodbye to people, so we were all a little bit, what? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. we all went to visit him. Yeah, yeah they all came to say Even the, the, the ones, uh, I was working with Tatiana and Ari, but Jordan and Maria, Christian, Kevin Hansher, all the OGs came came back. And, the OG OGs. Yeah, and they, OG. they said goodbye, yeah. and, and, and Graham and John uh, had some cupcakes for me, even, yeah. you know. Was it just cupcakes? Whiskey. Yeah. Whiskey. Yeah. Oh, and a bottle of scotch. <laughs> like, I don't think it was cupcakes. <laughs> that was scotch. <laughs> you know you're dead when you get a bottle of whiskey. Right. That's, right. That's right. It's a tradition. Yeah. All of Sarah's men are pretty much gone now. <laughs> Is there any Except Felix. Felix coming up. No, Felix is there. Yeah. Felix is always there. Cal's off in Iceland. Cal's not uh, not gone. He's just on ice land. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Will there be any romance for her in the upcoming season? She deserves a little. Right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, let's. I think that's not a terrible idea. Tatiana, is there anything? that you still want to do clone wise like is there something like you want to are excited to tackle that you haven't yet yeah i mean i think um like i don't know what it looks like i don't know who she is yet um crystal was a nice surprise yeah and kind of came out of just like joking around all the <laughs> I was like that's gonna be a character you play <laughs> in front of audiences yeah. um so so i think it's kind of nice to just stay open to whatever the season sort of offers us. Um, and I like being kind of surprised halfway through with a new person. We'll surprise mm -hmm. you. Yeah. Which dead cast or clone are you going to miss play playing the most? Uh, well, right from the beginning, we lost Seth. And mm -hmm. I think I was going to have a lot of fun with him because that mustache made me look like my grandfather. So that was <laughs> really, and his mom was just like, like every time I came on screen, she, it was a real flashback for her. But I think he would have been a lot of fun. But. Uh, I think they got a couple things up their sleeve and it's a clone show. At this point, does Felix need a love interest? Like a real... I would like it. Yeah. I would like him to have that. Yeah. Does he know he's fine being celibate for the next 50 years? <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? <laughs> the post-traumatic stress of the last six months has been too much. He's never going to date again. No, I want him to... I would like him to... I, I want it because I want to see what he looks like. In, in a very in a very intimate or private moment, I'm looking forward to that. So I hope that we get an opportunity to have something, because we got a taste of it with Colin. That was the most yeah. Let's have Colin back. Fun sequence Colin's to so shoot great. again. Helen Shaver is a brilliant, brilliant director, and she was so like the whole setup was so loose, and she just kind of said, "Do whatever you want to do, have fun with the props." And I love props. <laughs> <laughs> we also we got to see like. Um, Felix much more not joking around mm -hmm. in this season and season three like he was very tender a lot of the time there was a lot more diff so it's really interesting to see that I think <laughs> Mrs. S is Sarah's sister cousin is that weird oi, what is oi, oi. I think oh, you're me. my aunt yeah yeah oh. yeah is that is everything? We did the yes. math once, yeah. yeah. Is, it, I, is I, it first sister once removed? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, 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 I don't know, it's very weird. Hey, Christian, let's talk about that twerking scene. <laughs> of course. What, what was, it, what, what was yeah. that like? That was the most fun thing ever in the world to shoot, ever, ever, ever. Um, <laughs> Helen Shaver was directing that episode as well. <laughs> that, Helen gets all the best Yeah, she's getting a lot of good stuff this season. Uh, and it was the same episode as Paul's death, so it was sort of a counterbalance to um, of the weight of that yeah. and um, she came up to us and, and we worked out a few basic moves but she's like so do you guys need a choreographer or something like that and we're just like 
Just play the music. <laughs> You've been working for this. Yeah. In our daily lives. Yeah. <laughs> and how long did it take to shoot? I think we went through the whole song like we'll three or four times or something like that. Was it three? Two Twice. Twice. Oh my God, Two that's times. it. That was it. That's it? Yeah, and we just went nuts. I felt <laughs> sick afterwards. I was sweating. It was like a workout. Yeah. It was I found those, a $20 like, dollar bill stuck to my ass when I took it It was one off. of those end of night scenes yeah. where you just turn the camera on and like <laughs> and twice Rachel, and everyone goes home. Like <laughs> Rachel like grieving her father's death all, all day. Yeah. Oh, okay. It was like so dark, and then it was like, okay, go be a house, and I'm like, let's go, just take our butts out. <laughs> yeah, but that's sort of the joy of the show, isn't yeah. it? You go from like crazy super drama into <laughs> insane comedy. Yeah. Producers, can you throw me a season four bone, a little tease, something? Come on, scoop is my currency. Like Sarah's really come through slaughter this season and like discovered a few key things about herself. Um, and we think that uh, that now she's on another chapter of this journey, and, yeah. and to start it, she's got to go back to the beginning. I I, I think also too the um, wow. what was important for us was that after the end of season three, that we have a number of answers, we've had a number of uh, a lot of resolution, and that we're at a place now where we can kind of take a little bit of a breather in a way and then kind of almost like look into the beginning of a, the new rabbit hole and and it begin like kind of a little bit of a there's a little bit of a reset at the beginning of a season four so hmm. we kind of wanted a feel we want season four to have a little bit of a feel of season one again yeah with a like, weird eye with first weird person weird. first person <laughs> mystery again like back yeah, to yeah. back to that feel of like not knowing what's going on and seeing the mystery through Sarah's eyes again.